So we are going to welcome up onto our virtual stage, Frank Goldbeck from uh, the Golden, Me sorry, Golden Coast Mead. Uh, I learned about mead and Harry Potter and have been kind of obsessed with it ever since. So I cannot wait to learn more. Um, Frank has started 18 other meaderies, including one started by a legally blind beekeeper in Uganda. I'm so curious how that works, um, but cannot wait to learn more. So Frank, please take it away. All right, hello everyone. Thank you so much for having us. I'm Frank Goldbeck with Golden Coast Mead and we make alcohol from honey. So our mission is to light up people's lives, regenerate the earth and return financial abundance. I uh, put this slide deck together with my CEO, Andrew Maffey, who joined our company from Bootcraft in 2020. Oh, next slide, Kyle. Thanks. So our big why, why do we make alcohol from honey? Because alcohol is primarily extractive and destructive. At a $1.5 trillion industry globally, and it's just monocultures that uh, decrease soil organic matter and decrease biodiversity. We also know that bees are having a huge problem in North America. The colony collapse disorder and the stress of pollinator um, migratory beekeeping, we've got an opportunity to use that $1.5 trillion lever and put alcohol back towards a regenerative model with mead. Next slide. So how are we going to do this? We're going to celebrate regeneratively. With each bottle of our mead, the bees have to visit 1 million flowers. So the dollars that go towards that bottle of alcohol will go towards biodiverse nectar producing ecosystems. We're a four benefit corporation and that is our mission. So we have the opportunity for consumers to put their alcohol dollars towards regeneration. So this diagram illustrates that consumer's dollar goes to the meadery, which is able to spend more money on honey, raising that commodity price. That beekeeper then is able to put some of that money towards rents to regenerative landowners who are able to invest it in biodiverse soil building ecosystems. The consumer is funding landscape regeneration through their alcohol purchases with the UN Sustainable Development Goals, number 15, land regeneration. And our business model that underlies this is really exciting. We have really healthy margins. We have really large opportunities to grow. Um, with the wholesale cost of a pound of honey being around $2, we can turn that through our 10 years and 10,000 hours of mead fermentation knowledge into $24 to $70 at retail. Um, with the advanced wine market, we've seen those numbers be even higher. But currently today, we're generating that kind of revenue. Next slide. Second. So how are we gonna expand? We're already on the market, we're doing big events and we have the opportunity to work with some big brands that Lisa might recognize to uh, make mead today. And um, next slide. We've pulled over $2 million of mead, we've got great reviews and we're fundraising today. The next slide. We've raised over $70,000 and we'd love for you guys to join us, especially if you have experience in the CPG and alcohol spaces. But even if you're a retail investor, you can get in for around 170 bucks. So we would love to have everyone here join us uh, this week, today, whenever you can. Amazing, it's so cool. I'm so excited, love one. excited to see that thermometer bar going up there. Thank you, thank you, Frank. Um, I'm now even more mead obsessed. 